Hello. Hi. My name is Samantha. And I guess welcome to my channel. I don't know. I don't want to say I'm a... I'm trying to be a YouTuber because I just want the world to hold me accountable. Does that make sense? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use y'all to help me. Because I'm just going to put myself out there on the internet. And if I fail at the goals that I'm trying to do and the things that I'm wanting to achieve this next year, I don't know, I don't know what to say. Ah, I need y'all's help. Okay, so that's that. Um, my name is Samantha. I live in Texas. And I became a quadriplegic May 20th, 2018. And for the last year and a half, I've like completely hated myself. I hate this chair. I hate everything about... That's all I can do. That is all I can move my hand. Let me see this one. This one sometimes... It doesn't always have act right. You know, it doesn't always act right. Um, sorry, I'm like, I'm really nervous. I it's kind of weird talking to yourself in a mirror... It's just, y'all Y'all are on my mirror. There is, like, this really freaking sticky tape stuff that my mom found on, on, on YouTube, on Amazon, and you just stick it to whatever, and y'all are stuck on my mirror. So, I got my little notes right here. It's, it's pretty cool, right? The things you take for granted, and there's, it's just crazy. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. So I'm going to go over some goals with y'all and um, just put it out there on the interwebs and maybe get some good feedback, maybe get some criticism. I don't know. I don't know. Um, we're going to see if I can do it, right? That's what this is all about. Going into 2020 with Clear Vision. Got me some LASIK. So I can see. <laughs> okay. Okay my little list okay I want to spend more quality time with my son better quality time with my son and he's 14 okay teenagers suck um and it just like hurts me that we don't hang out you know and he plays video games a lot and that's like his he's really into it he's actually really good he plays Call of Duty and anything that anything that shoots he likes and I don't really like those games so uh, I got him a computer for Christmas we got the Xbox down here got everything set up I bought adaptive controls so hopefully we can I don't know connect over video games might as well get into what he likes since you know just if you have kids you know what I mean okay I want to have a better skincare regimen. I don't really ever wash my face. I know that sounds really gross. <laughs> but it's not like I go wash my face before I go to bed. Probably because I'm not putting on makeup every day. And um, I didn't put makeup on every day before either. I was working in construction. So I would just come home, take a shower. And that was that. Anyways, okay. So, I bought the, um, what is it called? Meaningful Beauty by Cindy Crawford. I figured that bitch has not aged f for 40 years now. So, might as well get her skincare. I don't know. There was a sale. So, I'm a sucker for sales. Let's just say that. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to use that. Start using that whenever it gets here. Um, I want to get at least three tattoos this year. And when I say tattoos, I mean big pieces um still still thinking on designs as I know I want an owl on me and um uh, still trying to figure out the best the best person to use so I want to do that I want to get into a manual wheelchair before May 20th that will be my two-year mark of being in quadriplegic and getting into a manual wheelchair will a, help me with losing weight because I'm going to be pushing my big ass everywhere. 
and B, make me look less disabled. <laughs> That's, I mean, this man, power wheelchair, like really makes me look like I'm really disabled. Like, I don't know. It's kind of, it's very weird going from walking to not being able to feel your legs at all. It's just very strange. Okay, I'll tell you all my story after I do all my goals. Um, I want to start driving. That's a goal of mine. I can't open this. I'm trying to open. I'm going to put on a face mask while I'm talking because I don't know what else to do. Just staring at a mirror talking is fucking weird. Um, I want to lose 10 pounds on my birthday. My birthday is on Valentine's Day. I just thought about that. How the hell am I going to weigh myself? We will come, we'll, we'll get, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Um, I, I need to learn to take a compliment. You tell me I'm pretty and your ass gets blocked. And I quit, I quit talking to you. I don't know. I'm so weird. I will chat up for hours and hours and hours. And once you start giving me a compliment, it's like, okay, bye. <laughs> I don't know. It's just... I don't know why. I need to learn to take a compliment. Okay. I don't want to cheat on keto. I am going to do keto. I'm going to lose a bunch of weight. I've lost a bunch of weight on keto before. I lost 100 pounds, actually, on keto 2017. 2016 to 2017. And, um, yeah. I'm gaining it back. It's not good. Not good at all. So, I don't want to cheat on keto. I want to call my friends more. If you don't call me, we ain't talking. Why am I like that? I have no idea. But I need to call my friends more. Um, I think it's because I just feel I feel like a I feel like a burden, and um, I let go of one of my really 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 close best friends because every time I saw her, I thought of my old life, and that's pretty shitty. You know what I mean? So, oh, I don't know what this, this stuff, it's clay. I don't know what I'm doing. Ah! Okay. I guess we'll just do this. Um, I want to get off meds. I live in Texas. So... We doing, we doing things. We doing things. Okay, let's just put it that way. I don't, I don't know who's all watching this, but get off of pharmaceutical meds and stick to other things. Okay, moving on. Um, so you know, if you look good, you feel good. So I want to make myself feel good. I don't, I'm not saying like I want to like get up and get all glammed up every day because I don't even have I don't even have clothes to do that. I threw away everything after I got injured. I don't know what it was. But it was like everything that I had I didn't want. I didn't want to touch anything. I had to wear all my makeup. I threw clothes away. I threw I don't know why, but I did. I want to learn to get into my bed myself. I'm using that Hoyer lift. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. I'm using that to get in bed. And I'm living with my mom and my dad, my son. And so my mom is my caregiver. 36 almost lady. Living at her parents' house. My mom's taking care of me. It's fucking sad. But that's what it is. It is what it is, you know? Gotta... I can't even get that over there. This thing is... This stuff... Oh, hell no. Okay. I'm rambling because I don't... I don't know what I'm doing. Um, Yeah, I want to learn to get in bed by myself. My son stays up later you know 14 right 
and I could be out there playing games with him, hanging out with him, but instead, you know, my mom's older woman, she wants to go to bed early, so I need to learn to do that myself. This is kind of stinging. I'm, I'm scared it's just going to fall out of my hand. Do this. Ooh. Got it. <laughs> okay. Anyways, um, okay, I, we, my grandmother did used to live here a while back. She died when she was 100 years old. Can y'all believe that? And, and we do have a chairlift that goes up the stairs. Not a chair, it's not like I can't put my chair on it and it raises me up. It's just a chair that you sit on. And it go, you know. And we have one of those, but my, I can't even get my big ass on it. And if I got into a manual wheelchair, I could get, I mean, I wish I could just take y'all off this stupid mirror and go around my house, y'all, and show y'all what I'm trying to accomplish. But I will have a tripod coming, I don't know, within the next week. Maybe I can give y'all a little tour so everyone can get a little better vision of what I'm trying to accomplish. But I haven't been upstairs since... May 19th, 2018. I have not been upstairs in the kitchen area since then. But I'm in the basement. It's kind of, it's like a basement garage. It's, it's not it's kind of weird to explain, but it's half basement, half garage. So I'm underground. So there's that. Where's my notes? Oh, I knew this was going to be a shit show cuz uh, I can think all day long, but speaking, I don't know. Okay. I want to finish my room. Um, oh, this, this room used to be two rooms. They, my mom cut down the wall. She didn't do it herself. But they had someone cut down a wall, you know, make this one big room. We remodeled the bathroom. So it's just a wet room. So it, it's fully accommodated for me here. But I have picture frames and macrame hanging things that, you know, hang plants and stuff. I bought all this stuff off Amazon. But I have, I don't know where to put stuff. Um, yeah, I need to finish my room. I want to get some more fish. I... I have two big ass goldfish. I put them in a 155 gallon tank a couple weeks ago. They were in a 30 gallon tank, which was, and they couldn't barely move in there. So I got them. Let me see if I can show y'all. Gotta move my whole mirror. <laughs> oh, well, you can see a little bit. This tank over here, it's just got two big ass goldfish. And two sucker fish. That's all that's in there. So I want to get some more food. I know that sounds that sounds stupid, but for it's a goal, you know. It's a goal. Everything is a process now. It's like a huge ass fiasco. Doing anything, getting out of bed, drying my hair. I mean, it's it's crazy. So let me just tell y'all what happened to me. I was at a work party wasn't even gonna go had no interest um the they had the picnic like five miles away from my house at this lake and i'm there i was there all the time like i know it's not anything special so anyways whatever it was real close to my house i wasn't gonna go my mom talked me into going so I went and I met a couple there. Hit it off real great. We were, it was actually a lot of fun. I had fun. Not gonna lie, I had a lot of fun. Um, I relapsed on cocaine while I was there at this party. And, uh, like, ah, oh, man. 
Yes, I'm a, I'm a recovering addict of lots of things, really, lots of things. But um, I chose to go to this party knowing that there was going to be drugs there. I don't know. I don't know what got into me that day. I have no idea why. It, like, addiction will just creep up on you at any moment, and then next thing you know, you're in it. You're in it. Ah! Anyways, rambling again. Um, so I did, I did a lot of cocaine. And I instantly hated myself. Like, I instantly hated myself. It was like, I was like chatty Kathy up until that point. And then I did it and I was like, done. My, my face, I could, people could just tell I was like pissed off. I went outside and I laid down on this bench. It was just, I, I don't even know where the fuck I was, but I was just laid out on this bench and people kept coming out there and fucking with me and, you know, asking me if I was okay, whatever. And I was just like, get away. And uh, then I found a hammock. And I went and laid on the hammock, fell asleep there for a little while. And people still just kept coming out there. I didn't even know these people, you know what I mean? So it was like, I don't know. Um, man, thinking about that really makes me want to cry right now. So stupid so stupid and so I went inside and I asked if I could go in the back seat of their car because I just didn't I, didn't, I hated myself like I spent so long trying to get sober and learning how to live a different lifestyle and then in one one night it fucked it all up so I went and laid in the back seat of their car and I Fell asleep. I remember the girl getting in. We talked for like a second. I don't She was looking for a boyfriend. I was like, whatever. I'm already in the car. Y'all aren't leaving me. I'm here. You know what? So I went back to sleep. Next thing I know, um, I'm, I, I'm waking up with a neck brace on in the hospital. I'm intubated. And after I woke up is when I, like, I remembered, um, Sparks. There was, um, they had to cut open the top of the car to get me out. And this wreck was a car by itself. There was no other, no other vehicles involved. It was just, they ran off the side of the road into a ditch. And that broke my neck. Like, what the fuck? What? And I had just gotten into a a wreck like three weeks before that ran into the back of this guy he just slammed on his brakes on George Bush and I just BAM hit him anyways whatever wear your seatbelt wear, wear your seatbelt don't fall asleep in your friend's car put your seatbelt on if you want to fall asleep sleep sitting up all jacked up whatever I'm I don't know. Anyway, so I have more goals, but I don't really know. I don't want to put too much stuff out there. Because <laughs> if I completely fail at this stuff, then, uh, I mean, you know, you know, I know, you know, I know, you know what I'm talking about. But I'm like completely fucking bored. I sit in this room and I watch YouTube and I watch the news. And, um, I've been really, really big into true crime. What am I doing? What am I, why am I, I just veered off. I was telling my story. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do this. Can't you do it? Y'all think I could do it? <laughs> so, I just want you to know this is just as awkward for you as it is for me. Because, um, you're the one watching it. And I'm literally staring at myself in a mirror talking. Which... Um, and my ADD is like kicking my ass right now. It is <sighs> whooping it. But I don't know. Um, I was just thinking about, I've been listening to the 911 calls and a bunch of true crime videos lately. And, um, 
there's some fucked up people in the world. Don't don't be fucked up. Don't don't do don't do that. Now, if y'all ever look up nine one one calls on YouTube, you'll hear them. And uh, I need to stop doing that because I am like, um, I don't like people. But I need some kind of interaction. Like, what am I, I'm just going to sit in this room and wither away. And, well, I mean, I can't, I'm a fucking disabled felon. <sighs> what am I going to do? How, what am I going to do? If you work from home, usually you're working with someone's credit card number. You know what I mean? You're booking a flight for them. You're setting up a trip. Working from home usually involves some kind of financial something. And, uh, you yeah, know. And, remember, this one looks so jacked up. <laughs> I don't know why it's like that. This one I flattened out in the hospital. Like, I sat on my hand. And then they were like, no, 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 don't do that. You want your hand to be like this. Like, no. I don't know. It might work for some people, but... It's weird to me. Anyways, Happy New Year. I was going to say that when I first turned this on, but... I don't know. I'm kind of scared, honestly, right now. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. I just know that I need your help. And, um... Yeah. I wish I could just take out my mirror right now and show y'all what I'm trying to achieve in this house. But I guess, oh, is this dry yet? No. I don't. I really hope I'm okay with this video and post it. I don't want to have to re redo another one. I'm just, I don't know what to say. Other than I need to, I need to lose weight. Okay, look, let me, let me back it on up, back it up. My, my chair stands me up. Did I ever say that? I know that was one of my goals. My chair stands me up and I need to stand up more in it. Okay. Oh, but a little bit. Let me see. I wish I was wearing a white shirt. This is what I look like. Mm, 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 mm. Yep, this is what I look like. Um, let's see if I can go up more. I don't have my chest thing on, so I'm going to fall forward. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Well, let me see. This is what I look like. I'm gonna hit the bed. Okay. Oh, and I wanna um, take more pictures. Take pictures of me and my son, me and my mom. I'm gonna just. I was planning on doing my makeup every day, honestly. Um, I'm not trying to become a booty a booty booty guru yeah i'm a booty guru a beauty guru by any means but um i want to make myself feel good i think i said that see i'm rambling i don't know what to say i don't know but i really hope that i can inspire other people to do what i'm doing um let's let's work together and i don't know maybe i can like film myself working out y'all want to film me grocery shopping i mean that's so weird right like people like to watch that but there's several youtubers i watch that i watch just because they're they're cool you know i don't i don't have any kind of personality right now i'm like really dead inside honestly um so i need to figure something out because this is not a good way to live for me being in this chair i'm th i'm kind of over that now um, but moving forward, how would I do to move forward from that now? You know, yeah, I'm in it. Okay. But I'm doing absolutely nothing with my life. So I think one and a half years was a good amount of time to get my shit together and grieve. I'm probably going to be grieving for a while, but... I am grieving more over the fact that I relapsed on cocaine.
cocaine. It's not even my drug of choice. Like, what the hell is wrong with me? I don't know. I'm sure some of y'all can relate. Once I get more used to talking out loud to a freaking mirror, then, and maybe I could like make notes of what I really want to talk about that day. I just wrote down my goal. Well, I typed out my goals and shared a few of them with y'all. I, I want to get this video out there to just get me started. Oops, excuse me. Um, I don't know. Think I can do it? I <laughs> think I can do it. That's so funny, right? Can she do it? Oh, I think this would be so cute if um, we put together like little, little skits or little like activities, painting. Oh, did I say that? I wanted to paint and do crafts more with this. That's uh, yeah. Um. Sorry, it's like my ADD just went somewhere else. What was I talking about? Oh, like little, um, like painting or little craft things or something. Like put together like a little kind of like a game show and get kids involved that are disabled and I don't know. Just see if they can do it. I mean, obviously, it wouldn't, wouldn't be anything, like, super hard, but I think it'd be fun. Can they do it? My nephew came up with that. I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. Put my arm. Put those back. Okay, well. It's been awkward. That was, that was awkward, awkward moments that we've had there for 26 minutes. But those 26 minutes is going to be the start of the rest of my year and I'm putting myself out there I'm being completely vulnerable right now I put a freaking clay mask on the first video okay so we know each other okay we know each other now um yes I'm excited I went shopping today and got keto stuff uh, if, if you don't know what keto is, it's just low carb. I don't count my carbs and all that. I just do sugar free and I try to eat no carbs. But I don't count calories or anything like that. I, it's called lazy keto and it freaking works. And I bought apple cider vinegar. I was going to take a shot of that every morning, which is already intimidating the shit out of me. I'm going to tell you the truth. It, this shit's gross. But it it helps. It really does. It make it made me feel better back in the day. Made my stomach feel better. I can't really feel my stomach, so I don't really know what it's doing. God, there's so much I could say. I could sit here for like two hours and ramble on, but I'm not gonna put y'all through that. But I want y'all to know I love you. I love every single one of y'all. Um, I don't know who's all watching this, but I'm putting quadriplegic in the title. So I'm figuring a lot of disabled people will come and watch these videos. And I'm hoping to motivate other people because I have been in a dark place for the last year and a half. And, I was, and I'm pretty new to being disabled. So people that have been going through this for years that we're still in that mindset I can just imagine like how dark it is for y'all like that just makes me very upset to know that there's really sad people out there like some of y'all been in my inbox okay I know I know what some of y'all going through so there's that um I'm gonna go ahead and stop this awkward ass video and oh god and get it on the interwebs and yeah okay bye love y'all so much hey no 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 
Hello. Hi. No. What the fuck? Oh my god. It won't stop.